NO Jeans, NO Issue GMA's Deborah Roberts concedes she's going to lose her jeans as she endures closet glitch at rec center. Great Morning America's Deborah Roberts has conceded to almost losing her jeans while experiencing a closet breakdown at the rec center. Deborah seemed to dislike keeping her jeans up as she hit the rec center for her ordinary exercise routine. She shared a speedy snap to her Instagram stories, clad in a dim Georgia Bulldogs tank top and more obscure dark joggers. The 63-year-old matched the outfit with dazzling blue hoka shoes with a peach pink feature. Both of her hands were at the jeans waistline as she was by all accounts battling to hold them up. She wore a disappointed look all over, looking down at her jeans as they seemed as though they had outgrown her. About to lose my jeans. She inscribed the picture. In another snap, she seemed to have fixed it as she was seen lifting loads. Another fast video Deborah posted saw her venturing this way, and that with an obstruction band around her lower legs, her jeans apparently now safer. It seemed to be the GMA anchor had the option to get her two enormous joggers at some point, the last time Deborah was at the rec center, she flaunted her staggering abs and trim figure in a dark games bra and tights while working out. Deborah took to her Instagram stories to share one of the manners in which she keeps in shape at the exercise center. In one clasp, she was seen swinging from a solid shaft doing pull-ups in the rec center she joins in. The 63-year-old was clad in a dark games bra and matching tights while doing crunches on the bar. She matched the look with blue tennis shoes, keeping her hair hauled back out of her face. Deborah cut a thin outline in her exercise garments. In one more class presented on her Instagram stories, she should have been visible doing sit-ups and crunches on the floor with her child Scratch. Deborah and Scratch, 20, ordinarily hit the rec center together to chip away at their wellness. She frequently shares the pair's exercises on her Instagram. Deb's New Beginning On Wednesday, Deborah uncovered her most recent well-being objective while presenting via web-based entertainment. The daytime television have gave a brief look at her new routine on her Instagram stories. In the post, Deborah snapped a pic of a table with a heap of books. The book of decision was examples scholarly and appreciated, The Instructor Who Transformed Me, which was delivered by Deborah herself a year ago. Close by the books was a glass of club pop, loaded up with a lot of ice and lime cuts. Deborah uncovered that it was anything but a mixed drink and that she was embraced dry January, stating, pondering the year with my club pop. Hashtag dry January. Deborah's level-headed month comes after her better half, today star Al Roker, 69, experienced different well-being emergencies regarding the beyond two years. Back in May, Al got a knee substitution and uncovered on the show that this medical procedure was a, a substitution of a substitution. He recently had a knee substitution in April 2022. Since his most memorable knee substitution, Al has attempted to walk consistently. A month after his subsequent activity, Al ignited worry from fans who discovered him seeming to battle during a live wellness section. The daytime television star was joined by well-being mentor Stephanie Mansour to introduce a portion on the everyday advances individuals can take to work on their well-being. Stephanie exhorted sluggish strolling followed by quick strolling and walked around the set with Al close by. The moderator appeared to dial back and battle to keep up as the health specialist changed to fast strolling. One fan said on Twitter at that point, he's truly battling might somebody at any point get him a seat. Deborah's fears. AL's knee medical procedure wasn't his main significant clinic trip lately after his medical problems in 2022 made Deborah dread that he wouldn't come to Christmas. He was hospitalized two times for blood clusters in his legs and lungs in 2022 and was missing from the morning show for almost two months. After his crisis clinic stays, the telecaster zeroed in on recapturing his shed pounds and strength. At the point when Al at long last gotten back to the morning show toward the start of January last year, Deborah returned to work at the ABC newsroom too. Albeit the couple areas of strength for remained AL's well-being emergencies, Deborah chose to enjoy some time off from work in February to loosen up after the troublesome time.